What's the story of 10 times 10? When the potion Maggie 10 meets another one, it makes her very, very hungry. She dives headfirst into the cauldron and comes out feeling very full. She gives an enormous magic burp and blows a bubble in the shape of a zero. 10 times 10 is 100. Remember my trick. You only have to memorize the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of 3 times 10? When Frankenstein meets the potion Magic 10, it makes him very, very hungry. He dives headfirst into the cauldron and comes out feeling very full. He gives an enormous magic burp and blows a bubble in the shape of a zero. 3 times 10 is 30. Remember my trick. You only have to memorize the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of 9 times 10? When Slimy 9 meets the potion Magic 10, it makes him very, very hungry. He dives headfirst into the cauldron and comes out feeling very full. He gives an enormous magic burp and blows a bubble in the shape of a zero. Wow. 9 times 10 is 90. What's the story of 5 times 9? When Flaming 5 meets Slimy 9 at dinner time, the meal is right there. He hurries to breathe out a beautiful flame to light the barbecue in the shape of a four. That Mrs. Flaming Five has prepared. Uh -huh. Dinner's ready. Uh -huh. Five times nine is forty-five. Oh, well, her. What's the story of five times eight? When Baby Flaming Five is suddenly frightened by Spooky Eight the ghost, wow. he jumps and gives a little fart. <laughs> the smell makes the ghost feel unwell and attracts the fly. Flaming Five brings out his fly swatter and, trying to hit the fly, he hits Spooky 8 instead and flattens him like a pancake. <laughs> Baby Flaming Five throws away his broken fly swatter in the shape of a four and breathes some hot air to bring the poor ghost round. But he breathes so hard, the Spooky 8 gets bigger and bigger and bigger, like a ball in the shape of a zero. Five times eight is forty. Oh, well. What's the story of 5 times 6? When Flaming 5 sees Scorpy 6 going by, he wants to tame him. He gets out his whip and he cracks it in the shape of a 3 and breathes out a flame to light the magnificent ring of fire in the shape of a 0. Aha, uh -huh. so who's the strongest now? 5 times 6 is 30. Oh, Remember my trick. You only have to memorize the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of three times five? When three can sign meets baby flaming five, he can expect to have the worst tricks played on him. <laughs> baby flaming five pulls out a big hammer and delights in banging nails into Threekenstein's head. <laughs> Luckily for Threekenstein, Daddy Flaming Five arrives <laughs> and takes away the hammer in the shape of a one. Three times five is 15. Remember my trick. 
You only have to memorize the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of three times eight? Three consigners cleaning his ears with a crank candle. But Spooky Eight, the ghost, makes him jump and he hurts himself with the tool. Furious, he throws down the crank handle. It lands on the Spooky Eight's chain and stops him from moving. Spooky Eight pulls as hard as he can to get free. He finally manages to break the chain in the shape of a two which whisks away the crank handle in the shape of a four. Three times eight is 24. What's the story of six times six? When Mr. Scorpy six, Meets Mrs. Scorpy Six. They give each other a big kiss. And a heart flies out. As it touches the ground, the heart breaks in the shape of a three. And an adorable baby Scorpy Six appears. Six times six is 36. What's the story of six times ten? When Scorpy Six meets the potion Magi Ten, it makes him very, very hungry. He dives headfirst into the cauldron and comes out feeling very full. He gives an enormous magic burp and blows a bubble in the shape of a zero. Six times ten is sixty. Remember my trick. You only have to memorize the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of four times seven? When Vamp Four sees the mummy Ram Seven, he can't help biting her. But he only manages to take a bite out of the mummy's handbag. She is so angry. She rears up and hits Vamp Four on the head, spilling everything in her bag. A fine banknote in the shape of a two, and several coins which pile up in the shape of an eight. We have an economic issue. Four times seven is twenty-eight. What's the story of one times nine? Mrs. Wonder One can't help playing tricks on her friends. <laughs> when she comes across Mr. Slimy Nine, she casts a spell and changes him into Slimy Nine Clown. One times nine is nine.